This video is brought to you by Lenovo's Star Wars Jedi Challenges, the augmented reality experience that lets you train to be a Jedi just like Rey in The Last Jedi, a movie. The first thing you'll see when you open it is an authentic lightsaber. It's one-to-one. -one. Some people call it Anakin's, some people call it Rey's, some people call it Luke's. You can call it whatever you want. I call mine Daryl. In addition though, you also get your headset for your head and a tracking beacon for tracking. This though, check it out, it's bloody one-to-one, -one, mate. It's got everything that you'd ever want. It's exactly the same. This little doodad on the end, put your keys on it, you'd never lose them again. So hey, get this, before I demonstrate, you need to know that you have to have a little bit of room around you just to make everything safe. You know what I'm talking about. I'm actually moving house at the moment. I don't have a living room or even a spare space to do this in. It's just boxes as far as you can see. It's crazy, but I have chosen this infinite white void instead. But the thing is, an infinite white void is not very representative of the kind of space that you'd play Jedi challenges in. So why don't we add, say, a chair, a potted plant, a second chair. Thank you. Right, so you want to place your tracking beacon on the floor in front of you. Then you take a standard smartphone with the Jedi Challenges app installed, because that's a good thing about this. Most smartphones work, like all of these. That's, 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 why is that loud? That's so loud. Now, if you don't have any of those, I guess you could just still buy it and pretend to play. I mean, I don't know why you would, that, that's insane. But it, look, the option's still there. So you take your headset, pull it over your head, grab Daryl, raise it up next to you. Sorry, ex excuse me, sir. I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm filming a thing. Could you, would you mind just moving? Just literally anywhere else, like somewhere, no, no. Listen, so, just somewhere else in this infinite white void, like over that side or even here, or any, any, any little, yeah, that's, yep. Good. Yep, over here's fine. No, no, just a little bit further this way. Kind of off. Yep. From the main menu, you're able to select a number of challenges from across the Star Wars saga. You can do the Battle of Hoth. You can go to Lothal like Rebels. The whole thing, it's a real Star Wars, you know what I mean? Let's give Hollow Chess a go. You remember this from the Millennium Falcon? It's crazy. It's like it's right in front of me. Ha ah, ha ha! Got him! Oh, he's dead. What a game. This is incredible. You seeing this? Oh, no! My biggest guy! Oh, he's out. Next up, we've got Strategic Combat. Now, this might actually be my favorite game from all of them, and I'll tell you why. Because it's like a real-time strategy, but it plays out around you, in front of you. And you control the troops, you point them here, you point them there, they attack each other. You can do this. Ha-ha! <laughs> And you can also bring in hero characters, like your Obi-Wan Kenobi, you know, kind of turn the tide of battle. Of course, this isn't the only battle you can do. There's a number of them leading all the way up from the prequels up to the modern saga. This though, I think is the one that people are gonna love the most, the lightsaber combat. Now there's a number of Star Wars villains you can take on, like a Darth Vader, like a Darth Maul, like a Kylo Ren, and some others that I'm not gonna spoil here. And the good thing as well is they've actually mimicked the combat of all these characters. You got your lumbering Darth Vader, walking around like a man who's lost all these arms and legs. So tricky. He's doing so many flips and spins. This part here I actually filmed in a friend's house that I snuck into whilst they're at work. Lenovo does not endorse sneaking into people's houses to play Jedi Challenges. The reason I did this though is to demonstrate because this is augmented reality, you'll be able to see the room that you're actually in. I should also mention that as you progress, you're able to unlock force powers like force heal and force push, as well as different colored lightsabers like a Yoda green or a Mace Windu purple. Look at this guy. He's bloody, he's out of control, mate. All right, that'll do it. Now Star Wars Jedi Challenges, because it's app based, that means there's going to be some updates coming real soon down the line. But hey, it retails for $1.99 US, and if, if you want to get it, that's, that's, an, that's an option. You, you're allowed, you, you can get it.
that's, that's, that's the end of the video.